Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video and welcome to our after the theater Reaction on this very rainy gloomy day. We came to see violent night. No Violent, violent. night. It is right. Yeah, okay. violent. I was thinking it had Christmas in it for some reason <laughs> Finally came to see this movie and these are just gonna be our quick little thoughts about the movie as always an elite team of Mercenaries break into a family compound on Christmas Eve uh, Taking everyone hostage inside. However, they aren't prepared for a surprise Santa Claus is on the ground and he's about to show why this Nick is no saint It's a Santa Claus movie, but it's a very very violent Santa Claus movie So this is not for <laughs> like the whole family with children maybe like a family like when you're just like adults you know or like teenagers and stuff because um there's a lot of stuff happening a lot i really like the guy who plays santa claus santa claus david Har harper, harper. He, of course you'll know him from um stranger things or black widow His tattoos you know every santa claus has to take off their shirt and show off their like all, all their tattoos mm -hmm. they'd be like awesome i really like him as santa claus mm -hmm. how his hair is is, is cool. nice i like it when he put it up in a ponytail yeah i really like the story it's like it's got like a twist in it you you know of course who are the, the people thing, yeah. yeah who are the people that are gonna rob them mm -hmm. yeah but the ending i'm like Oh, mm -hmm. I did not think that was gonna go this far. Mm -hmm. But Santa Claus has this hammer. It, it's a cool hammer. The bone crusher. Yeah. yeah, skull crusher. Skull crusher. I don't know. I just really liked it. All the violence in it. There's like very graphic deaths, which I really like. Like a star. <laughs> the fogginess. Yeah. <laughs> There's a lot of greedy mm -hmm. greed going on. So yeah, I enjoyed it as well. Honestly, I wanted just a little bit more violent. It wasn't as violent I was ex as I was expecting it to be. It's a quick movie and we get to it pretty quickly, but it's not exactly how I had imagined it to be um, because of him kind of coming into his own to become this violent person or finding his former self kind of deal santa claus because santa claus was a person beforehand from the trailer i just got him that he was gonna be like more of a badass type of mm. santa claus and not kind of from the get-go like i thought oh you're gonna know like you're gonna be like mel gibson fat santa you know or fat man you know the fat man that came out last year if you guys haven't seen it where you know santa claus they be making him violent these days this movie is kind of similar to bob odenko uh on deck i don't know i um uh, yeah, I know who I'm talking about. From Nobody. This is kind of like the Christmas version of Nobody, which I love that movie. Um, that movie came out like a year or two years ago. You remember that movie, right? Yeah, I love that movie. So, yeah. So, this kind of reminded me, right? It, yeah. it, it, it gives you those vibes. So if you a protection. Yeah. So, if you enjoyed Nobody, then I think you're going to enjoy this one. John Linguizano also comes on it. So, this is another movie. The second movie that we've seen this month. Well, technically, we saw the menu last month, but... John Leguizano, it's in two really good movies. If you have not seen The Menu, I highly, highly recommend it because that movie is amazing. It has some funny uh, parts to it as well, like with the reindeer and everything. <laughs> but uh, yeah, those are pretty much our quick little overall thoughts about the movie. Just we're kind of getting straight to the point and, you know, trying not to get too much lingering going on. And then plus it's kind of like, ooh, look at that. Look at that. Y'all see how that ugly it is? It's not that bad, you guys, but it's like, uh, it's gonna be cold up. So dark. Uh, but yeah, if you guys haven't already, go ahead and give this video a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified each time I post something new. What are you gonna give it? I guess I'll do a medium. Oh. Yeah, I would give it a medium as well. I mean, I technic we technically gave it four stars on Letterboxd, but I was really honestly debating between three and a half, and I think three and a half might be more of a medium popcorn. It's like a medium with the Coke. Yeah. Yeah, that's what it is. It's a meeting with the go. Alright. If you guys have seen My Little Night, let us know down below what did you guys think about it. Did you love it? Did you like it? Did you hate it? Or was it just not for you? I plan on checking it out this holiday season. Alright guys, that's it from us today. Until next time, see you guys at concessions. Bye.